Hello everyone, welcome to Math Score. It's Vedic Math Level 2, Day 25. And today we will learn about Spatial Division Method and this is Part 4. In this part, we have to learn about Vedic Math Technique for Division by 101, 102 and 103. So let's start it. But before that, if you are new to this channel, then please subscribe this channel and press on the bell icon. Also, like, share and comment for this video. Let's solve some example on division by 101. First example is 189 divided by 101. So first of all write down this 100 place digit 1 here and multiply it with 1. Because if we add 1 in 100 then we will get 101. So 1 multiply by 1 is equal to 1. Now subtract this 1 from 89. 89 minus 1 is equal to 88. Now divide 88 by 101. So it is not possible because 88 is less than 101. So this 88 is a remainder and 1 is a quotient. Second example is 675 divided by 101. So write down this 100 plus 6 here and multiply it with 1 because if we add 1 in 100 then we will get 101. So 6 multiplied by 1 is equal to 6 and subtract this 6 from 75. 75 minus 6 is equal to 69 and divide this 69 by 101. But it is not possible because 69 is less than 101. So 69 is remainder and 6 is a quotient. Let's solve some example on division by 102. First example is 188 divided by 102. First of all, write down this 100 plus digit 1 here and multiply it with 2. Because if we add 2 in 100, then we will get 102. So 1 multiply by 2 is equal to 2. Now subtract this 2 from 88. So 88 minus 2 is equal to 86 and divide this 86 by 102. But it is not possible because 86 is less than 102. So 86 is a remainder and 1 is a quotient. Second example is 568 divided by 102. So write down 100 plus digit 5 here and multiply it with 2 because if we add 2 in 100 then we will get 102. So 5 multiply by 2 is equal to 10. Now subtract this 10 from 68. 68 minus 10 is equal to 58 and divide this 58 by 102. But it is not possible because 58 is less than 102. So this 58 is a remainder and 5 is a quotient. Let's solve some example on division by 103. First example is 1067 divided by 103. So write down this 10 here and multiply it with 3. Because if we add 3 in 100 then we will get 103. 10 multiplied by 3 is equal to 30 and now subtract this 30 from 67. 67 minus 30 is equal to 37 and in the next step we have to divide this 37 by 103. But it is not possible because 37 is less than 103. So this 37 is a remainder and 10 is a quotient. Second example is 325 divided by 103. Now write down this 100 plus digit 3 here and multiply it with 3 because if we add 3 in 100 then we will get 103. So 3 multiplied by 3 is equal to 9 and subtract this 9 from 25. So 25 minus 9 is equal to 14 and divide this 14 by 103. It is not possible because 14 is less than 103. So 14 is a remainder and 3 is a quotient. 